Yeah, my phone just started randomly ringing, and uh, I wasn't prepared for that. Hello? Aniki? Hmm? Wait, me too? Yeah, do you have a sec? I need to talk to you about Arakawa-san. It's about the allies he's gonna need to. <laughs> you bet I have time. I've been waiting for this call my whole life. Thanks. So yeah, Arakawa-san, he's actually... Actually what? Hey, hold on, Ichiban. What's all this about going to Osaka? <laughs> it turns out Arakawa-san needs some help. My help. Mitsu just called me and said Arakawa-san's already on his way to Sotenbori. But why Osaka? I don't know. I didn't bother to ask. Uh. You realize Sotenbori is where the Omi Alliance is headquartered. You'll be screwed if your cover gets blown. Think about that, would you? All I need to think about is that Arakawa-san said he needs me. He's going to Osaka, so I'm going to Osaka. I don't care what anyone says about it. <sighs> he gets like this, Tadachi-san. And there's no point stopping him, is there? Loyalty is admirable, but jeez. Ichiban, what about Ijinsho? The election's coming up. We helped you make all that money to fight Ryo Aoki. Now you're just gonna leave us hanging? Not at all. We got the three million yen we needed. And I'm gonna go give it to the Seiryu clan right now. We may have the money, but that hasn't solved our lack of a candidate. Certainly a necessary element of the plan. Didn't Chairman Hoshino say he'd take care of it? Don't worry. He's the kind of guy who keeps his word. If we give him the cash, he'll do the rest. If you say so. Safe travels, then. Hey, don't encourage him to do such dangerous things. <laughs> Kasuga, if you really are leaving, we're coming with you. Sounds good to me. I've never been to Osaka. Guys, I'm not going there as a tourist. I'm going straight into the lion's den. Assuming Adachi-san is right and that's where the Yomi home base is. You guys don't need to get involved. This is... personal for me. Come on, man. After all we've been through, aren't we friends? Of course. I'm saying this because we're friends. If something happens to me out there, you gotta finish what we started. Still sounds like a load of crap to me. Well, think what you want. But we got the three million yen, and I'm taking it to Hoshino. I'll see all of you around. All right, uh, I'm kind of confused, but okay. All right, and we're here. Ah, if I can enter these doors correctly. So you found the money? Yes. Me and my friends managed to make it somehow. I owe it all to them. <laughs> <sighs> Maybe I should have asked for more and kept the change. Not even funny, sir. We worked our asses off to hold up our end of the bargain. How are things on your side? Well, in that regard, unfortunately, there's no way to let you down easy. I haven't found anyone. No one who can handle Ijincho, huh? <sighs> right, with Aoki's popularity behind him, finding someone who stands a chance against Kume is no small task. <sighs> Understandable, I guess. But I still intend to work on it, I, I promised. And uh, you've helped you your your end of the bargain. Wow, that was hard to speak for some reason. Yeah, I have to skip town for a little while to take care of some stuff. I hope you've got some good news when I get back. Mm -hmm. Really, where are you going? Osaka. So it's in Bori, specifically. That's rather sudden, isn't it? Yes. Well, that's where Arakawa-san needs me. And he's counting on me to be there. And who did you hear that from? A fellow Yakuza guy, before I went to prison, he called me. I've... I've heard rum, rumblings about Arakawa heading to Osaka on my end as well. The captain of the Omi Alliance is getting out of prison, so he's going to be there when he gets out. The captain, huh? 
So he's higher than Arakawa's son, since he's just the acting captain. Very well. Correct. Masura Watase. It will probably be the first time Watase and Arakawa meet. To Watase, Arakawa is just an outsider from Kanto who shot up the ranks in his absence. If he makes even the smallest mistake in that meeting, it could be his undoing. Even Arakawa might be nervous about that. You think that's what he needs help with? I don't know about that. <laughs> you can ask him yourself, but a word of caution. Yeah? I just hope you don't get another bullet to the chest the moment you make eye contact with the man. Well, I've just gotta trust him. To be honest, I've never really stopped. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm going because he asked me to. I'm sure it'll be different this time. <laughs> I wish I had more subordinates like you. Does my father really need to attend to this Sotomori thing personally? Yes. Remember, as acting captain, Arakawa is merely keeping the seat warm for Watase. Being there in person will be a show of respect and good faith. Fine. But why am I just now hearing about this? I said I wanted to know if he so much as breathed somewhere outside his usual places. My apologies, young master. I only just found out myself. Really now? Well, all we can do now is wait and see. Hmm? Wait and see what, exactly? Masaru Watase and Masumi Arakawa are finally meeting in person after how long? If I know my dad, they're not just going to say hi and be on their merry ways. I highly doubt they're plotting anything. Isn't the Omi chairman still bedridden? I've heard it's terminal. Yes, that's correct. Then it's past time for a potential successor to be formally named. Actually, it may not be that urgent yet. But then again, the chairman might say Watase's release from prison is a good time to step down. And then Watasi would become chairman, naturally. I'm sure his reign would be a very long one. But Omi history will take a very different course if, say, Watasi disappeared. What? <laughs> I'm thinking dear old dad might try to make it happen. I don't know if that's arakawa son style, exactly. You don't think so? Remember when I asked dad to sell out the Tojo clan during the 3K plan? Well... I never told him to bring in the Omi Alliance. He did that all on his own. I think it was a good decision, actually. Don't you? Uh, well, sure. Thanks to him, the Tojo were driven out of Kamocho. The 3K plan was a wild success, and my approval rating skyrocketed. I expected the Tojo clan to fall hard, but I didn't think some third-rate Tojo vermin like Dad could ever worm his way into their top ranks. <laughs> Shrewd of him to do that during all the commotion. I thought he was a slow, antiquated Yakuza. And certainly not the type of man who could catch me off guard. Huh. I guess power really does corrupt, huh? Don't get me wrong. If Dad buries Watase and takes over the Omi Alliance, I benefit too. Having him there would be very convenient for me. There's just... One thing that feels off. What's that? He hasn't told me about any plan to off Watasi at their meeting. That's evidence against my theory. I'll have to see what happens. If all they do is greet each other, I was wrong. Look. <laughs> On the other hand, if he wastes Watase and still doesn't see fit to tell me, that would be a betrayal I cannot tolerate. Arakawa-san won't betray you. He better not. His little Yakuza club only has power because I extend it to them. <sighs> I've come a long way since the Kamurocho 3K plan. I'm at the top of the political pyramid now, which means I need to know what's happening in the underworld. The hierarchy should be very clear at this point, and I expect people to fall in line. That's a matter of policy, and family is no exception. Sawashiro, between me and my father, to whom would you swear complete fealty? Ara 
Akawa-san sent me to do as you command. His orders were to put you and your interests above everything else. My interest is for you to watch his every move and report them to me. Understood. I'll send Tendo to Osaka. He seems to have rapport with Arakawa-san. Ah! Patriarch Tendo! When'd you get in? Just this afternoon. Tomorrow, the captain's getting out of prison. Oh, really? <laughs> Not something civilians like you need to worry about. The wise thing to do would be to mind your own business. Is that a threat, sir? Don't joke like that, man. Your fists ought to require a weapons permit. Say what now? Nothing. I got work to do, just like you said. See ya. Hey, can I get a refill over here? Oh, make it two. Ah, hey, really, guys? You look like a teenage girl waiting for a text from her boyfriend. Put it <laughs> down and relax. Have a drink with us. Yeah, we're in Osaka after all. Stop giving me shit. See, this is why I want to come alone. Oh, come on, Ichiban. Where are you going, Kasuga-san? I bet it's not to take a leak. We hardly drank a sip. Yeah, where am I going? I have no clue. Oh, I can't walk up here? That sucks. Ichiban, where are you going? It's way too dangerous just to walk around. I don't know what I'm doing. waiting for this call from Mitsu. Could be any second now. Didn't he say he was busy planning Watase's welcome back from prison party? Something like that. Some big party at Omi HQ. What a load of crap, huh? Can't he see that Arakawa-san's plans are way more important? Well, but wasn't he expecting you to be here tomorrow, not today? Dude, you're the one who jumped the gun and got here early. Kinda douchey for you to complain now. Who are you, Mama Kasuga? Someone's gotta be. But hey, listen. I overheard something that'll interest you. There was a group oh. of people in here chatting about Arakawa being in town. It's big news, apparently. Really? Yeah. Sounds like folks are worried that a war might break out between Arakawa and Watase. And it's just a rumor, but wisdom of the crowd and all. Shh. I got a text. Oh, come on, really? From Mitsu? Aw, oh, man. What the hell? What's wrong? It's from Nick Ogata. Huh. He texted me, I finally got a pick with Kamala. <laughs> Great. So glad you told me about that, Nick. Ichiban, you did you see my photo? Nobody ever manages to get a pick like that. That bunny, he's so crafty, you never know where his fuzzy little ears will pop up. I'm beside myself. I can't believe I found him. All right, all right, I get it. Huh? Uh, what's got your coat? <sighs> I'm sorry, but I'm really tied up right now. It'd be a big help if you didn't call me for a couple days, okay? Well, look who's a busy bee. You visiting a lot of pretty flowers these days? No, it's nothing about girls! Listen, I'll call you when things settle down. I'm happy you found Kamala. <laughs> <laughs> Just teasing. Why are you so mad? Be more like Kamala. He's never hopping mad. I gotta go, man! Yeah. Goodness gracious. Hopping mad. <laughs> mm. uh, sorry. Ichiban, you need to settle down. Hey, Kasuga. Oh crap, he's really if you're drunk. You're gonna be a pain in everyone's ass. Just go to Omi HQ already. Huh? Come on. Since when do you sit around and wait for anyone, anyhow? <laughs> Besides, if a war really does break out like these people think, 
Your precious Arakawa-san could be in actual danger. <laughs> hey, Adachi-san. You're absolutely right. Screw waiting. Time to go. God dang it, yeah, Kasuga. That's it. <gasps> like devils on each other's shoulders. <laughs> so stupid. Why can't we ever just stick to the plan? We're heading into Omi Alliance HQ tomorrow. And who knows what'll happen. Better be ready for anything. Pretty sure there's a big shopping center down by the river. Yep. Good. We should be able to pick up what we need there. By the way, if you're having trouble at this point in the story, like you're like, how am I going to get three mil? Uh, just go to the Ichiban Confections and just upgrade it to Smithereens. And you will get anything and everything you could ever need from there. Mm -hmm. It gave me like around 11 mil, honestly. Uh, but yeah, it's pretty easy. Just do that. I can't believe how lit up the city is at night. Imagine how much electricity this street alone drains up. And speaking of which, did you know Kansai runs at a different electrical frequency than Kanto? What the heck? You made it sound all sci-fi. It's not. Kanto simply runs their electricity at 50 hertz, whereas Kansai uses 60 hertz instead. So when you go from here to Kanto, some of your electronics might not work. Huh. Well, you know your shit. Wait a sec. Were you gonna try and leech power all the way from Sotenbori? <laughs> That's ridiculous. You even have to ask. It'd be way too much work to steal different currents of electricity. That's really not the issue. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love these people. Great. They're the best. Ah, I'm running into everything. What the heck? Ow, ow. Dude. This is... That was... This music is cool, but look what's going on. Hey, Sacha. Tell me you love me. Put in the Kansai dialect. What the? Why? I don't know. I just think girls speaking Kansai sound cute. Then let me love you, darling. Yeah, that's pretty good. Say something else. I'm a little tight on money this month. Maybe a big sweetheart like you could help? Well, shoot. Here you go. 500,000 yen. Much obliged. Hey, now, I'm only counting 50. <laughs> That's the Osakan way for you. What is the Osakan way? I'm pretty sure that's just between them. <laughs> oh man, I love these con conversations that you, yeah, you, you get to listen to. They're just incredibly funny. Zhao was the what is who's? Oh yeah, Zhao was the shopping center you mentioned. Yeah, but it's under construction. Uh, Are they not open? Dang. What the heck? Shall I show you in? Huh? Whoa, the robot talked. Oh, it's Yapikun. Hmm? Yapikun? A guide robot. A, a lot of mobile phone store and the stores and supermarkets have been getting them to greet customers and stuff. You've never seen one? Wow. Uh huh. That's a uh, high tech. So that means this guy is greeting us, right? Yeah. Guess so. Maybe they actually are open. Uh, I'm not gonna do that, boys. Go for it, little guy. <laughs> uh, so cute. What? Even is this? Looks like a fighting ring. Or if you're normal, construction. This doesn't look open at all. Yo. What's the big idea, Yappy? Where's the shopping area? Shopping? I'm sorry, I don't understand shopping. Welcome to the Sotenbari Battle Arena. Hmm. Battle Arena? This is a place where warriors with confidence in their skills come to clash. 
We are the strong challenge to stronger that we have selected. All fights are broadcasted live to our members. Any challenger who succeeds in defeating the foe will receive a reward. <sighs> Kamarajo has an underground coliseum just like this. I suppose they must be national. Okay. Now then, have at it. Go fight. Hmm. Oh yeah, go fight, sure. Listen, you little robot, we don't have any intentions of fighting for the enjoyment of your people. Actually, it might not be a bad idea. Huh? We may be fighting the Omi Alliance soon. This could be the perfect opportunity to polish up. Besides, underground members only established like this tend to have a lot of backing. I'm sure the reward will be more worth it. We could upgrade our weapons and equipment and train while we're at it. <laughs> the benefit outweigh the risks, in my humble opinion. <sighs> well, I guess when you put it that way... We'll not force you to participate. If you wish to fight, talk to me at any time. We do not turn away challengers. We do not hunt down those who leave. Our arena is always open to got you. It. All right, got it. We look forward to seeing you fight. Okay. Okay, once we're ready, let's take a taxi to Omi HQ. All right then, we'll head to Omi HQ in the next one. See ya, everybody.